Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I know I look literally crazy today, but I thought I'd hop on here and give you guys a video. Today, we're gonna be trying Domino's garlic parmesan wings because Domino's, that's disrespectful. Papa John's garlic parmesan wings and their new stuffed crust pizza like I put my glasses on for this one, guys. Wow. Like, have you seen anything more beautiful? Like, hold on, let me get this. Uh, what are they called? The little clips? Oh my gosh, you guys. We have so much to talk about and a Mountain Dew. And I haven't had a Mountain Dew in a minute, so I'm going to enjoy this fucking Mountain Dew. I'm definitely also if you guys seen this on the side of my face, please ignore it. It looks like crap I also need to get my nails done shout out to Madison. I'll be there soon, babe But yeah, I'm going through a Growth spurt just kidding. I'm actually breaking out. I never break out. I haven't been wearing makeup for like ever now I'll just apply some lashes and some gloss Unless I'm doing like a TikTok. like I think the last time I wore makeup maybe like two weeks ago when I went to Atlantic City with my brother and his girlfriend but besides my breakout let's jump into what we're here for the food <laughs> all right I'm gonna go ahead and try this they even gave me a garlic dipping sauce see this is oh yeah I think I'm so hungry, guys. I'm hungover. We'll talk about that. Let's talk about it. Went to my brother's last night. Had a great time. Got to hang out with the kids. Got to see my nieces and nephews, which is always fun. And then, of course, after hours, the adults had some drinks. And I got fucked up. So, <sighs> hit the spot. I'm like, I'm more of a Domino's fan and not so much um, Papa John's. Mm, it'll do. Oh, comment below. What do you guys prefer? Papa John's or Domino's? All right, I'm going to try this, the crust. bringing back school memories you know how they would serve a stuffed crust pizza at school sometimes sometimes that's what it's given me let's recap guys my trip to miami if you guys haven't already watched that make sure you guys go check that out that was my last video that i have posted on here you guys can also watch full clips on my family friendly only fans page but um yeah the trip to miami was phenomenal i have never really got to experience miami i've never been to miami well actually i lied i was on my i actually went to miami for the show i recall and it was cool but like you know i was there for work so i didn't really get to like enjoy the whole trip but this time Oh baby, yeah. it was a trip and it was cool because it was like a couple's trip. So everybody was like coupled up. I would definitely nine, 10, go again. Without a doubt. I loved it. Let's try this garlic sauce. Mm, I love garlic. I remember when I was a kid, I didn't like garlic, but you know, you grow up and your taste buds change, I guess. Oh. Mm hmm I also got these Papa John's um, garlic parmesan wings. I always get buffalo wings. 
And I love buffalo wings, like nothing against buffalo wings, but I didn't want it today. I said, let's try something new. Ooh, okay, a little ranch cup. And also, what do you guys prefer, flats or the drumsticks? I am a flats girl. Please don't touch my flats. Because then I'm going to have to lay you out flat. I still hate them, but I don't love them. They're giving me different. But different stuff, so. Update on my OnlyFans. I just started doing cosplay, which is something that I was thinking about doing, but I wasn't big into watching anime. And I feel like a lot of cosplay has to do with, you know, anime. Like, they get their inspiration from a lot of the shows. But I just got into it. I feel like it's so cool to be able, be able to express myself in a different way like I feel sexy I feel empowered I get to be like a whole different person for a few hours and just enjoy my life you know so I recently did um Foxy Love I ended up doing Shigo I did Velma and now my next big thing I'm gonna try to get this video up before Wednesday, which I'm sure I will. I'm going to be cosplaying Jessica Rabbit. And if you guys don't know who Jessica Rabbit is, she is from a movie that was made in the 90s, I think, obviously, called Who Framed Roger Rabbit. And she's married to a rabbit named Roger Rabbit. So therefore, her last name is Rabbit. You've got to watch the movie. It's a great movie. You guys can find clips of the looks that I do anywhere, usually. if you guys are ever interested in starting one of these pages it does not have to be adult I think I've said this before you guys can do whatever you want on this site you can sell any service you want you can teach someone how to whistle and get to where you need to be so I want to update you guys on my relationship I know you guys want to know you nosies but I'm gonna try a um I'm gonna try a drumstick because I feel like the flats have a lot of fat in them. And you know, I'm already contributing enough fat. Come on now. So we're gonna bite one of these. Mm. As I stated earlier, we took a trip to Miami together. We're always taking trips together, so. I feel like it keeps our relationship alive. And also we just get to fight in a different state, which is cool. I'm just kidding. We always have a good time when we're together. We're working on deciding if we want to rent or we want to own, but we have so much to experience still. You know, we're in our 20s and we're doing good right now financially, so I, I'm not sure if owning the home is something I want to do right now instead of, you know, do something like rent and bounce around a couple states and see how the world's living. He's really my best friend, so I literally don't have any friends. <laughs> my friends are my mom, my brother, and my boyfriend. And then a few friends I have. You guys know who you are. Lately, I've been really to myself and really focusing on my work. I'm trying to get more content out to you guys. I'm trying to update you guys more on my life. Trying to take you guys on trips with me. I want you guys to feel like you're with me all the time. I want you guys to experience my life. Since I'm not shy about that, I'm very open about parts of my life. I don't mind sharing with you guys. Sometimes sharing information can help other people in ways we don't know, shape or form. Maybe I'll motivate somebody, I don't know. Maybe you didn't eat today, you're gonna have a pizza, great. Maybe you didn't film something, you wanna go get up and film a TikTok, do a dance. That's exactly what the heck I want you guys to do. Not saying that I don't have bad days. 
because everybody has bad days and like I've been there done that still been there still doing that you just live life day by day and you keep going find a reason to be happy for the day anything pick anything you want I know it's not that easy so so as soon as we got home from our trip to Miami we instantly started planning our second trip we came back home in February and that was exactly when I decided I'm taking my nieces and nephews to Disney. I automatically saved up the money, bought the house we're staying at, bought the plane ticket. I ended up buying the Disney tickets not too long ago. And we're basically set and ready to go. This is exciting to me because I have went to Disney one time before my life. It was for my 14th birthday and I had the time of my life. Disney is something to remember. Disney is like magic on steroids. Like, I don't think anything compares to Disney World. So my nephew's birthday is in October. So we planned to go literally the night before his birthday. And he will wake up in Florida ready to go. I'm super excited about it. What's really exciting about it is I've been planning this for a few months. I'm excited to surprise him with this. He's gonna like love it. And the best thing for me at Disney, honestly, is the fact that I can get on every single ride. Every single ride. I can't do that at Six Flags. I can't do that at Dorney Park. I can't do that at anywhere else. There's a few rides that like my height is the cutoff because I'm 48 inches which is four foot exactly and usually they won't let you on the ride unless unless you're over four foot tall but um or accompanied by a parent so you still have the risk of like flying out because you're really not supposed to be on that ride but i'm pretty heavy set you know what i'm saying i'm big body can't wait to go on the tower of terror literally that was my favorite ride in disney because i love the twilight zone if you guys have never watched The Twilight Zone, I'm not sure if it's still on Netflix, but it was. It's a very weird, sketchy show, but um, sometimes it made a lot of sense. So I don't really like the pizza, but I don't hate it. It's definitely not Domino's. I need some chips with this pizza or something. Me and my brother's girlfriend are starting a diet this coming Sunday. Uh, um, I've kind of already got into the gist of working out. I've been working out for like a few days now. I did hire a trainer and then I got uncomfortable. He was super cool. Nothing against him. Um, I'm just a weirdo. Started exercising by myself and I stopped because I'm a slacker. And then I started up again. So I've been exercising for like maybe four or five days. And now I'm indulging, which is completely fine. So after this pizza on Sunday, I am going to start meal prepping. But I found some super cool, fun meal prep ideas. So it's not going to be boring. The flavor is going to be giving what it's supposed to give. So I'm ready to start. I, and I also have a trail where I live that I can use to work out at. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start walking. Stop drinking dark liquor. I love dark liquor. So when I go out, I have a few shots dark liquor. Gotta cut that out. Um, I don't eat a lot of sweets. I'm not a big sweet girl, but I love bread. I eat so much bread that you might as well call me bread. Pizza. It's been real. Oh, last but not least, I wanted to update you guys on my teeth. Um, I'm getting super tired of having to travel between New Jersey and Atlanta because of my teeth because I decided to get my teeth done in Atlanta. And I think the orthodontist told me one time that I can't get my teeth done anywhere else, you know, after they work on my teeth, which sounds correct. 
but it's such an inconvenience now because I'm more in Jersey than I am in Atlanta. So I have to fly back and forth like once a month, which is cool though, you know what I mean? So if anybody wants to collab out there, let me know. We can collab. I have like a whole nother year of traveling apparently. Other than that, my teeth are doing phenomenal. I'm keeping up with them. I just bought a brand new water flosser. I don't know if it's up here. I think it's downstairs. I guess there's like levels to this shit. So my braces now have thicker, don't look, I was eating, bars or something. Like the bar that goes across is so much thicker than the one that I had before. So I'm like, how am I floss in there? So, um, I can't see you guys too well. So, um, I bought my water flosser and honestly, you guys, braces aren't that bad. I have the biggest gap, like right here. These are, are my two furthest apart teeth. My two Bugs Bunny teeth. Um, they were the furthest apart. So literally when they tightened it, I heard it crack, you guys, crack. I heard my gap crack. I was a teensy bit traumatized, but I moved past it. So I'm so excited for the next few months to come. I'm really trying to work my butt off so that I can meet my goals and quit playing around. You know what I mean, guys? I really appreciate you guys tuning into my YouTube channel tonight. Um, dinner was phenomenal. I'm going to save the rest of this pizza for later because, you know, I'm each about to be hungry. This is great. I'm ending the video now. I have to use the bathroom. This apparently hit the spot, but it was so good talking to you guys. I can't wait to be on here again. I'm sure the next time I'm on here, I'll be going somewhere. I'm not sure where yet, but we'll figure it out. I also wanted to try out this new product on here. So we might do that. That might be my next video with you guys. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and I will see you next time. Bye.